So like to go ahead and purchase cheap and instant pre-transfer GTA 5 modded accounts, Call of Duty recovery services, discounted games, and in-game currencies, and click the link in the description of this video. Yo, what's up Prestige community? It's Glitch Gaming here, and I just wanted to say that it would be sick if you could come check out my channel. So click the link in the top of the description for more videos like this. What's up guys, it's Glitch Gaming here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to get any director mode character into online. So if you are new to my channel make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you do not miss out on any of the latest GTA 5 online glitches. Now I want to give a quick shout out to the founders of this glitch which are Savage Crew YTB, there is Salim and Finding666. So shout out to them guys for this glitch and a special thank you to Savage Crew for letting me use his gameplay. So go and check his channel out, he's so close to 10k and don't forget to subscribe. Now just before I show you how to do this glitch I want to say a quick few things just so you know and you're not wasting your time if you don't want to do it anymore. But for this glitch you will need a new PSN account. Now obviously you'll need online on that PSN account but some people may think that you need to buy it. What I did was I made a new PSN account and I got the 14 day trial which is obviously free. Now I think you can do this glitch on Xbox as well but you'll need to find a way how to do the recent activities which you do on PS4. So anyways you will need a new account with PlayStation Plus but you could just use a free trial and every time you do this glitch once you restart GTA you will need to do it again so you will be able to run around in GTA as any director mode character as long as you want but once you restart GTA and come back on you'll need to do the glitch again to get the character on obviously so it's a it's a little bit pointless it's still fun to get the director mode characters on but I'm sure even a director mode money glitch will come from this or something so it's a definitely a good step in the right direction so getting into how to do this glitch to start off, once you're on your new account and you've started up GTA, you just want to do, you just want to complete the prologue. And once you get onto Michael, you will be given the missions from Lamar, and you want to complete the missions. And then once you're in free mode and you spawn on Michael, just like me here, you want to come to this exact location, which I am on the map right now, and you will see a building on top. Now you don't have to come to this location; you just need to go and locate a. Uh, Pyote plant which I'm about to show you me eating it right now but from this plant you need to have a bird you can't use like a leopard or whatever you get from it you need to have a bird so you could come to the exact same location that I came to or you could locate a different Pyote plant it doesn't really matter you could just check some tutorials out on YouTube there's plenty of locations where these little plants are but I actually got a hen which I don't think works so it's, that was a bit annoying, but once you've got a bird and you've ate the peyote plant, you want to hold right in the d-pad to get out of the animal. And once you've done that, it'll show that the animal has been completed. Now once you've done that, you want to open your phone and go to quick save and you want to make a new quick save slot. So once you've done that, all you want to do from here is go to online and you want to press on just a normal session so press go and this will then spawn you onto the character selection page which obviously you haven't made a character on this account yet so just accept all of the pop-ups and you should see that there's a completely new character right here so you just want to press X to edit or A if you're doing this on Xbox and if you are doing it on Xbox let me know if it does work so I can update the comments section now once you've created your character you'll get a page that will come up and it will say do you want to skip the GTA online tutorial and you want to press X or A to accept that and once you've spawned into a GTA online session you want to pull up your pause menu go to online and press swap character so this is going to back, take you back to the character selection page and once it does you should see two characters but the one that you created earlier so as you can see mine right there you want to delete this character by pressing square and it will make you type in delete so you, you can delete the character but only delete the character that you created earlier 
and you just want to wait for it to delete as you can see and once that's finished you should see that only the one character will pop up and in the bottom right corner you'll be able to see that there's only two selections that you can press and that is circle you want to press so it'll take you back to story mode and once you've loaded in it should put you back as Michael and you just want to pull up the pause menu go to game and load up the save that you made earlier from your phone so once you've done that it should actually reload your game so that may take a couple of minutes just wait for it to finish and once you spawn back into story mode you should be Franklin and you just want to open up your interaction menu and press director mode at the bottom of the interaction menu screen now this is only I'd say the tricky bit to this glitch it's not even that hard really but this is the only part I could imagine people getting problems on so once you've spawned into the director mode trailer what you want to do is go to actors you want to press on animals and you want to go to any bird that you've got unlocked but usually you should only have the bird that you got from the piety plant earlier so apparently the pigeon is the best one to do it with so just select the bird that you're using and you want to pull up your map and set a waypoint in the sea and once you've done that you want to open your interaction menu go to location and you want to select your waypoint now as soon as you select your waypoint and you press X you want to go to a recent activity on your PS4 that says start GTA online now once you press start GTA online it'll take you back to your game and you want to decline the alert now once you've done that you want to wait for the pigeon to start dying just like this and you just want to keep pressing start GTA online declining the alert keep going back on and keep doing it until it starts saying wasted on your screen now I don't know if you can do this on Xbox or not but just if you can let me know in the comments section and a quick tip that you could use is double tap the PlayStation button so it keeps taking you back to start GTA online recent activity you want to press it decline the alert press it decline the alert and just keep doing it until it says wasted now once that's happened you should spawn as the bird again now all you want to do is open your interaction menu and launch director mode again so if you're having any trouble ease with this part then just let me know down in the comments I will try and reply to everyone but that's the only tricky part really but once you've done that anyway you want to go to actors and you want to go to any actor which you want to choose for online so say you want to be the space ranger you can select the space ranger and you can now take it online so just select any just any one that you want I don't think you can use animals or anything but you could use the police outfit or something but I'm going to be using the alien and I'm going to be taking that online and once you've selected your character you will then be spawned back into the sea which your waypoint was from earlier in the video now pull up your interaction menu and exit director mode and you will spawn at the hospital and you'll still be in story mode so from here all you want to do is go into an invite only session or you could go into a public session if you wanted and once you spawn in that is the glitch successfully done so you can now run around as the character you've selected for as long as you want but as soon as you restart GTA you will need to do this glitch again so I suppose it's quite annoying in the fact that you want to do it all of the time but you won't be able to save the outfit which is a bit annoying but it is a simple glitch and if you really want the outfit you can just keep doing it so I hope you do enjoy this video do let me know what you thought of it down in the comments and I will be uploading another video a day as well so keep out for that it's probably going to be a money glitch so I hope you did enjoy this video if you did leave a like subscribe until next time see you Just keep folding them knots Just feeling
climb all the way to the top. Yeah. Yo, what's good Prestige community, it's Zav or PMHD here. Don't forget to check out the director featured in today's video if you enjoyed it. Sub link is at the top of the description. Check out our previous videos too. Subscribe, stay tuned, stay prestige. Peace.